What's up everybody? Tina with AJ's Lawn Care here and uh, me and Ricky have a pretty good sized pruning job to do today. We're going to be uh, raising the canopy of a couple trees, uh, pruning some lantana, some Christmas trees, some crepe myrtles and stuff. But today we're going to be using our leaf burritos. We have the, the five foot bag here and then we also have the seven foot bag that we're going to be using later. And so the leaf burritos are not just for leaves. Uh, like I said, we're doing pruning today. So we're going to be cleaning everything up, putting all our debris onto the leaf burrito. And because it has these extra handles all around it, it'll be easy to lift up and carry to the trailer since it's mostly rocky terrain all the way to the street. And so it's going to be a big help with the handles. So you're not trying to, to muscle a, a tarp that's falling apart and get it to the trailer. So it'll be nice and easy to lift up transport but uh let's get to work and uh we'll get right back to you all right guys we got it all in i'm just gonna grab one side i'm gonna push down Kind of put your weight on it and reach for the other side. Here we go guys and as well you can carry it from here to the trailer or we can use two guys so quick side note the reason why i think that the leaf burrito is perfect for solo operators because the ease of using it and transporting material with it because of the handles that they put on there that are sturdy and uh just put in the right spots to where you can use it and get it to where you need to go so you can see i cut a big big branch off of this live oak tree and if you know live oaks you know they grow in every different direction every different way up down sideways and so you pretty much got to cut them up to be able to get them in your trailer and, uh, and set them right so they're not sticking out everywhere and so I cut this big branch up and you see I got it on the uh, seven foot burrito and uh, I'm going to use it because I happen to have a grass strip that goes straight out to the truck. So that way I'm not dragging it over the rocks and potentially tearing it. But uh, these are the handles that I'm talking about that are at every corner. There's a handle there, another handle at this corner, two handles there, handles at these corners. I mean, this thing is made so you work smarter, not harder. But uh, I'm about to pull this. I'm going to pull them with these two handles put them together and pull it straight back. So you can see with this handle here, if you know if you ever use tarps and you're trying to drag them, you gotta grab them by the corner and twist it and hold it with your hand to get a grip and then it slips out and you're just having a bad day after that. So with these easy handles, grab both of them, squeeze it together and there you go. No slipping, no pulling, no breaking, no tearing. Everything stays on the tarp. It isn't sliding off because it isn't a slippery material. There it is. Everything's by the truck. Nothing fell off. Nothing slid off. You know, if you're trying to pull stuff with tarps. You pull it too hard and you'll pull the tarp right from under it and everything will fall off and you're back where you started. Everything stays on here. That's the one thing about the leaf burrito. Also, like when you're doing leaves, you can lay this flat 
and because it has these holes in it if you're blowing leaves onto it it won't lift up it won't flap away it won't do any of that because the air just goes right through those holes and your leaves go right on top well we're about to wrap up this job we're going to load up the five foot one we're going to uh, fold it up and get it pulled to the trailer and get everything wrapped up so that's a wrap y'all we got everything picked up loaded up so as you can see i mean the leaf burrito the convenience and durability of it i mean it helps you through your cleanups leaf jobs whatever you're doing from start to finish i mean we stacked with it we transported with it we've loaded with it and now we've used it to strap stuff down so as you can see with the handles we have it in the corners this is the seven foot bag corners are bungeed down and because it has these handles the straps just don't lay on top they're actually through the handles we got the corners bungee down we have a five foot bag in the back and the only reason why we have it strapped down is because we don't have a gate on our 16 footer but if we did have a gate you could put this here you could stack three four five up on top of each other they fit real fine and now we're loaded up everything's tarped down leaf burrito down and we're ready to roll to the next job and then to the dump and like I said, if you were doing small trimming jobs, if we were just doing flower beds or whatever, we could just have a few of these five foot bags. We could have them all stacked up. And then when we unload, take them off, unzip them, dump them, and you're done. So, I mean, there's so many uses with the, the leaf burrito you could do. Not just leaves, but uh, cleanup, transportation, uh, getting from point A to point B. And just so much easier with the handles. The heavy duty zippers zip up real good. Like I said, this is all lantanas that we put in there. And as Ricky showed you, zips right up, ready to go. Easy to move around, easy to transport. Um, I don't think I'll ever buy another tarp. <laughs> no reason to. I mean, this thing, it, it does it all and uh, does it well. So uh, we like it. We use it. Like I said, we don't just use it for leaves. We're using it for cleanups today. And um, it's a good thing, man very good very good <laughs> we'll talk to y'all later but on to the next one